I'm trying to put some things together. Like, turns out this Birch Society is not in Russia. It's like really anti-Russian. I, I misinterpreted the song. No, the song should have told me. Um, no, okay. What happened was, um, I've been trying to find out what that what that was because uh, someone else's channel told me it was relevant. I didn't know why. The Birch Society. Uh, my, I, I guess my grandpa was like anti that or something like that. But that doesn't mean shit anti, you know what I mean? Because Thomists are Catholics, right? And they disavow uh, Thomists as inspired uh, like a church father, like so Thomas Aquinas, if they dis, they don't consider, but that's what they are. Uh, it has something to do about whether or not they believe that um, ministry is uh, ordained and follows the line of the succession of St. Peter. Um, but because they open up to all of their um, faiths and and attest to truth in all other faiths and even uh, have uh, practices uh, like um, they'll engage that are, are pagan and everything. Uh, they are the ones that still say that you have to be ordained in the ministry in the line of the succession or something like you. So you can be a, you can't be a Catholic if you're not. So that's what makes them Tom Thomas. So the John Birch Society has people that right now attest to their being fascist. And I wouldn't disagree, but they haven't distinguished themselves from anything different because they get happy when they find out that uh, there is a quelling a coup and, you know, for a fraternal conflict to go interstitial is, would be seemingly the same goal of the John Birch Society. So the John Birch Society is the CIA. And I have a source that told me that, and I'm tending to think that because of everything I just explained, how they can portray both their progenitors and and their uh, their opposition. Because it's really just <clears throat> war. It's just war hockey. This has something to do with the, the new technological age. I don't think they would do this. But it seems like maybe since the last uh, 80 years or something like that. To try and uh, create interstitial conflict in Europe. Because they're just, it's like, you want to win so bad, but you don't understand starting wars in other regions and other countries to, uh, to affect the end of a, a, you know, a smaller conflict. How's that good? How's that good? You have to be walking down the street and just like Louis C.K. said, like watch your uncles if they disappear, evaporate, and be like, well, it's not weird because we live in a in a war zone where you can just be walking down the street and uh, your uncle's uh, head is just fucking disappeared off his shoulders. So it's like, you can never like it just doesn't make any sense that this is a good fucking thing 
I think it's because like, is it weird? Like they've never, it's just because they've never seen a dead body or something? Like, it doesn't make any sense. You wouldn't have to have to see a dead body to have any sense, do you? It doesn't make any sense. Do you want to go see a dead body? Oh, 